guys, it is the 18th of May today. My name is Jess McDonnell and you're watching GameSpot News. First up today, Xbox boss Phil Spencer has said more JRPGs could be on their way to Xbox One. When asked by a fan on Twitter if any JRPGs were in the works for the console, Spencer replied, it's a good and fair question. Keep asking until we show you something you like. I can't share any specific plans now, sorry. In November of last year, Phil Spencer promised JRPG fans that they would see more of the genre on Xbox One. Microsoft's consoles have been home to a few exclusive JRPGs in the past, like Blue Dragon and Lost Odyssey, both of which came from the creator of Final Fantasy, Hironobu Sakaguchi. Currently, the call for more JRPGs on Xbox One has attracted over 3,500 votes on the Xbox feedback site. Doom fans have something to be excited about today as Bethesda have just released a 10 second teaser video for the upcoming FPS. The Blink and You'll Miss It trailer has about 3 seconds of gameplay, featuring a gun being loaded and a beastie with shoulder mounted guns. Taking up the other 7 seconds of the video is the game's logo and the confirmation that Doom's worldwide gameplay reveal will take place at Bethesda's E3 showcase on June 14 at 7pm PT. If you're desperate for more seconds of Doom teasing, don't forget they released a 45 second teaser at last year's E3. Finally, Soda Project have released The Witcher 3's Day 1 patch notes. The patch contains fixes for stability and overall performance improvements, including reducing texture pop in instances. Also featured are changes to quests, AI improvements, UI optimizations, and support for dynamic 1080p scaling for the Xbox One version. You can check out the full list of patch notes in our story on GameSpot. The Witcher 3 unlocks right now, so you'd best quit wasting your time with me and go get stuck into it if you've picked it up. Let me know what genre you want to see more of and why down in that comment section. You can head to GameSpot where we've got stories on Casey Hudson moving to Microsoft and Capcom planning more remasters. That is everything I've got for you today. Have fun playing The Witcher for those of you who've got it and I'll catch you again tomorrow.